Hey, Orange Nation, it's Liz. We have another news video coming at you today because we got some stuff from once and always, which I'm definitely going to be talking about, but we actually have some other awesome stuff, uh, starting with what happened earlier today. Up for pre-order, we finally got uh, SPD Yellow and Lost Galaxy Yellow. Both of them are up, not just at Hasbro Pulse. Um, the, in the tweets, they said there were GameStop exclusives. Now, even if it's a GameStop exclusive, yes, Hasbro Pulse is still going to get uh, a few because they want their Pulse member, Plus members, whatever, to get them. However, they're not GameStop exclusives either because uh, they're up on Entertainment Earth and Big Bad Toy Store. So pick, I mean, it's going to be a fan channel exclusive, both of them. So just pick whatever one you like to order from and, uh, and go crazy. I will say Maya's, her face sculpt doesn't, I don't know. I mean, I think, I think Z's looks a bit more like herself, but... Uh, anywho, I'm digging it. I do like her hair. I think her hair was pretty spot on. I, the morpher is not right or whatever, just because it's not ever right. So just don't assume it's going to be. But I'm digging both of her weapons, uh, all the poses and whatnot. I, I need to get her, honestly. I have... So I still need SPD Red because I just didn't get him when he first came out. And now he's actually really hard to find. But... Yeah, yeah. I have all the other SPD ones, so I will definitely be getting Z. Uh, I'm passing a Lost Galaxy just because I'm not going to get any of them. A Lost Galaxy, it's a fine season. It's some people's favorite season. I've just, I've only really watched like half of it. It just never really caught me on very well. Uh, I do like the posability just with that stuff. Her Quasar Saber is not right. Um, again, I'm not a huge fan of the season, so I wasn't really sure, but people are like, it's it's in a weird position or something for how she has it so and eh, they're gonna cost you either $24.99 or $25.99 just depends on where you get your pre-order from i do love a giant old bazooka though and that uh blast effect part is pretty dang sweet so yep that's everything she comes with the helmet I, I mean, if the only, I don't want to say if the only thing we have to complain about is a Quasar Saber, it's like their main gimmick, but y'all know, y'all know how it is. Um, so that is, uh, so those are the new pre-orders are coming out, but with that came a brand new Lightning Storm, uh, which is posted today, if you guys know, Lightning Fig PR, Josh, uh, Toku Topics, he's been my buddy for a really long time. I was, you know, he was starting and we're just like, Josh, you could do this, you could do this, man, and now he is actually going to be celebrating... Togo Topics episode 200. Believe me, I did 200 episodes of the Ranger Rehearing Review, and then that's where I ended it. It is a feat, it is a monumental task. He has done amazing things, so please, please, if you can, on Saturday, it's not a live thing, but on Saturday, he will be posting the 200th uh, episode of Lightning Storm. But yeah, on Saturday, please give it a watch. Please like it, uh, share it out. It's a monumental task. Congratulations, Josh. Uh, I'll be in there chatting along with everyone else. Before I do move to the really awesome stuff with Once a Ranger, uh, we have some really unfortunate news, um, but it's also a way you can help. Ika Darville, who you would know as Scott uh, Truman from Power Rangers RPM, the Red Ranger, uh, his son, Mana, has been diagnosed with an incredibly, incredibly rare, they haven't seen it before, brain cancer and to do everything they can to help find new treatments, to help try everything on the cutting edge. That, of course, takes it takes a community and it also takes a lot of money. So he has started a GoFundMe. I will have all the information about it below. Uh, please go watch the video. I, as a parent, I mean, my, my heart's just breaking. I mean, you don't have to be a parent to have your heart break, but like, I can't imagine seeing my daughter going through the same thing, the worry and all. So if you want to go, um, please go check out all of this. I'll have the links below. Um, yeah, so please get well soon, Mana, and uh, Ranger Nation is going to be fighting for you, buddy. We'll keep you, I'll keep you updated uh, on the story and everything as it progresses. So flipping to a bit more of a fun way this is kind of the ease into the hype right um so monday april 17th this actually this came up but three days ago i did this three days ago because power rangers has given us nothing for once and always right 
we we had gotten like the main day and it was just like it's freaking crickets this thing is happening in you know under two months and so i decided that on monday april 17th two days before once and always we want to make sure we can get a lot of hours on a lot of time zones so if you want it we just we just want hype i just want once and always hype I don't care what it is you do. If you just want to post memes or just simply make a post, we'll have a hashtag. It might just simply be hashtag Power Rangers 30 and like hashtag once and always or something like that. But we're going to have a hashtag that we're going to be using. And we just want to flood everyone's timeline with Power Rangers and our excitement for this. The Power Rangers is celebrating its 30th anniversary. And uh, and I think it would be an absolutely amazing time to do it. Get all the hype going for once and always. So... Who is going to be doing the music for once and always? That was some hype that we also got on the 11th. Oh, my goodness. So, Ron Wasserman is the OG composer. He wrote Go Go Power Rangers. He wrote Call the 541. He wrote Go Green Ranger. He wrote The White. Like, all of those. It's him. It's Ron Wasserman. It's his voice, right? Oh, my gosh. So, he pops in on Ranger Board. Shout out Ranger Board. Uh, it's where I, I cut my teeth in Ranger Board. Uh, the man himself, Ron Wasserman, posted asking everyone to check his IMDb. That is just one of those, you knew Ranger Nation was going to flip. Y'all like, go check it. Come on, I just updated it. Go check it. And uh, yeah, and absolutely, the man who literally wrote the music to the Bible, the, the, the franchise, that today, 30 years later, we're still using riffs and crap at Google Power Rangers. Ron Wasserman is doing the music for the comeback special or the whatever special uh it says two episodes i would just think that that's because it was so long like a television episode power ranger episodes are usually only like 22 minutes i'm thinking that's why unless he's coming back for a second one uh i don't know we will see we will see so now for just the biggest thing they finally gave us a picture 36 days Intel Morphicon, Mighty Morphin Power Rangers Once and Always premieres exclusively on Netflix globally April 19th. Globally April 19th. So now I'm going to pop, put up the bigger picture uh, so we can actually see this a lot better together. You get the four, um, you have Zach, Billy, Kat, and Rocky are going to be in it. And that, y'all, that, that's Robo Rita. That is Robo Rita. That is crazy. I mean, she does look terrifying. You can tell. I mean, it's with the hat and the way that's going and the collar. Uh, we'd been hearing Robo Rita anyway. So that is just. Oh my gosh. She looks terrifying. I love it. I love it. Man, I just love. Like, look at those suits. Like, that material. It just looks more you know they got the new like arm if you didn't notice on the arm pad you can see on billy uh it's it's got like more of a texture to it, it isn't just flat like blue pleather or whatever anymore it's it's something man it's something. i am just uh well i guess i'd say i'm just counting down the days because as of today it is 36 days um i wonder actually what are you guys doing for uh to watch so I'm on the fence to either watch it my like watch it myself, just grab some tissues, you know, watch the whole thing by myself first. But then I've also thought about watching it live, like the first time as a watch, like a group watch. So I don't know. I might watch it by myself first, but I'm definitely there's gonna be some streaming parties, there's gonna be some watch alongs, it's gonna be bonkers with the amount of love that this is gonna get. Make sure, you know. I'm just gonna be like, just post, make sure you post on your real Facebook or whatever. But uh, maybe you had some childhood friends that didn't know this existed yet. And man, we, I, I hope this is so big that it just breathes this huge new fresh life into Power Rangers. And they're like, Hasbro's like, oh, let's put them back on the main shelf. That would be amazing. But you never know. You never know. Uh, just keep your fingers crossed. Hope for the best. Tell lots of friends, and, you know, hopefully they'll be putting out more stuff, trailers, whatnot. I mean, I hope we get a trailer. Um, if not, hopefully we'll get a trailer, but if nothing else, uh, try on April 17th, if you would, to help get the hype up. Because 
we need all we can get it in ranger nation so yeah we got uh tuna figures up for pre-order please this saturday go watch josh's 200th episode april 17th we boost the rangers uh ron wasserman is coming back to the 30th anniversary and we got our first look at robo rita who looks absolutely terrified if you'd like to donate ika darvel's son mana uh could definitely use your help and support uh, and if you can't donate financially just the thoughts and prayers um use the hashtag and everything follow their journey and give them your support anything is going to be helpful they have such a long long road ahead of them and uh, ranger nation should be with them every step of the way so i'm ranger liz if you haven't already like comment subscribe all that jazz thanks to my patreons for uh, being there for me always and if no one's told you today i love you and i think you're awesome i'll see you in the next video we're on twitch twitch.tv slash ranger liz